Let's now move on to the eyes. We're going to do the eyes a little bit differently. I could do it the same way. I could select the eyes and then put a fill layer on it and then change the blending mode. But I'll show you a little bit different way of doing it. If you have shapes on your image, you can create a new layer. And before we move on, let's go ahead and rename these so we don't get confused later. And this one is going to be eyes and mouth. And you want the edges of your brush to be the same size as your eyes. And you want to have a pretty hard brush. So the hardness is kind of high-ish on that. And you want to choose the color that you're going to have before you begin. So this is black. His eyes are already black, so that's not going to change anything. So I'm going to change his eyes to a different color. Maybe that. Let's see what that looks like. One thing to know on this method is you will not be able to change the color later because you have done it with your paintbrush and it will just make it a lot more difficult to change the color. So make sure that you have a color that you like before you begin. And I think I like color for this one. Now select your eraser tool. You can push E for that and erase out unwanted areas. You don't need to do anything with the white of the eyes because there's no color there. They're supposed to be white, so they will be fine the way they are. Now we're gonna do the mouth. The mouth does not have any specific shape to it, but it is difficult to select just the mouth because it is uh, very similar to the skin color. So if you just try to select the mouth, it's going to select more than what you want. And when you try to subtract color, it's just not going to get what you want. So I have elected to paint the mouth on. Again, choosing a color that I like before I begin. And we don't want to make it look like he's wearing lipstick. Babies don't generally wear lipstick. So we'll do kind of an orangey red maybe. And then you can back up and see how you think that'll look. I think that's a little bit red, so I'm gonna change it. and Make it on the more orange side. Too orange. I think that should be pretty good. We'll get it done and see what we think when we're done. And since these are teeth here, I'm going to use my eraser tool and make some of those teeth back to white or gray, as it were. And there's your eyes and your mouth. So at this point, you should have all of the skin finished and the whole head finished. We'll go ahead and pause here, and when you finish, you can move on to the next video.